Hi guys, welcome to a short video about how to blur parts of uh, pictures for free very easy and uh, my recommendation is the Photoscape X. So what I'm usually using to capture something is the light shot. That's the thing here to mark something and then uh, put something into the clipboard like this here and that's already stored in the clipboard and then I can use it in the Photoscape. But you can use whatever you want to use. I mean there are many uh, possibilities to uh, put something into the clipboard. So how is it going with the Photoscape then to blur something? Yeah, I want to show you this from scratch. So how to install? We hit the Windows key uh, start the uh, store here, the, the Microsoft store, and then we can look for the Photoscape. Photoscape X here, that's the thing which we need and there's a free version and it supports many many things and also this blurring thing here, I have already installed that and it's a good thing, It I think there's absolutely no virus, no, there's no spam, no ads, no nothing, I have already installed that so I can invoke this thing from here, yeah that's the thing, I click here on this Photoscape and what's important here that's really really important and that's the reason why i made this video it's not super easy but uh, as soon as you know how to do that it's very easy you have to be after it opens you have to be on the editor none of the other uh, tabs here you have to be in the editor if it's uh, if you're in the cutout it's not working you have to really start in the editor and then don't open or make a new one or something else just paste this thing here that's the thing don't do anything just paste it on this empty space and then go to tools and then we have this blur thing here and then you have many many different options you can change the size of the blur area uh, you can also change the hardness you can do many many things and you can see how easy this goes here with the largest option you can blur many many things here very very easy whatever you want to blur so it's gone and you still have some of the uh, background you can see where it was of course yeah you can change the hardness and, and and these things and you can go back and and, and do other things so it, it, it's a really nice thing what you can also do is to reverse these things if you decide after that yeah okay maybe some part i need maybe even a smaller one you can go back here and then have this back so this is a really awesome thing and it's absolutely free no ads no nothing i can highly recommend that i'm not affiliated with them just wanted to show you that because it always has been working the best and so i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments or better solutions just let me know down in the feedback area i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time